Hey guys, Night Ops here, and we are back with some Infection Free Zone. This is currently our third episode of our French castle settlement of Caracasson. We are currently kind of like just setting up some kind of defenses, just kind of protecting some of the areas that we have. Um, I know it's out the gate. I think this guy actually came through the wall. I'm not 100% sure. I think he was in one of these buildings originally. But we do already have somebody coming back anyway, so it's not too bad. Uh, we'll kind of just see how this goes. Just kind of getting, you know, quick start here on this uh, on this uh, episode. I, oh. oh, yeah, I do want to say you guys have really been awesome. Uh, we are currently at 194 subs. And it's been just over two weeks now, I want to say. Which has been wild. And we have just over 3,000 watch hours now. Well, let's do that. I forgot about my markers. So everything's been pretty crazy. There we go. So yeah, both of them just kind of came through the walls there. But you guys have just been, like, awesome. Uh, the constant feedback has just also been great. Sorry if I sound kind of weird. I just uh, haven't been up long. <laughs> and I think I might be coming down with a cold. I don't know. Just, like, kind of stuffy this morning. I don't know. Send them all to different places. Uh, so I think this kind of tells me that I need a tower over here now. Roger. Ready for action. Come on. Roger. Going there. Let's do it. There you go. Roger. I've actually started Roger. playing uh, Star Citizen Let's on the side it. also. Ended up getting a nice Going pack there. that went on sale. Um... And I've actually just been having a lot of fun with that with my buddies. Uh, they're currently about to have a decent update. Uh, let's see. Come on. Clear out your inventories. You guys are really not wanting to actually empty out your inventories, huh? Like, God. Uh, I'm going to lower... Uh, you're gonna go out and help him just kind of collect that stuff real quick. Ready for action. Let's do it. Roger. On my way. Going there. There we go. Uh, let's see. Ah, I forgot they'll actually come out here and drop stuff whenever you reload. Sometimes. Yeah, I figured out why I probably have so many issues too with my um games bugging out. Uh, from what some of the people said in the. Uh, Steam uh, discussion is that the ultimate killer of saves is legit just saving and reloading later um, Can just cause like massive game-breaking bugs at times And I'm like, oh, you know, that's cool. That's awesome <laughs> it's Like, you know, I'm not always wanting to sit down and play like an eight-hour session to Get enough footage, but I might have to start doing that just pre-recording a lot of stuff and then just Coming in and recording my intros afterwards. Whenever I go to edit. Um, which might have to be the plan. Uh, there's still stuff there. Uh, now let's see. I want to do... Hand so I have about roughly seven handguns, two ARs. Oh yeah, we are building farms out. I've totally forgot about that. Yeah, because we're building the cookhouse. Uh, we're building a shelter here. Just getting some basic amenities up. Uh, and then we'll just kind of see how everything goes. Oh, so he filled back up too. Uh, just come here. Uh, some fuel, some ammo. infected over there so this bug's still going like that that mission's still staying there clear. 
Uh, but it's not something too, too, too much to worry about, I'd say. Uh, let's start inviting some people, because I do have shelters building out. I'm going to have a cookhouse, some farms. So we'll start inviting some more people. Uh, we're gonna get a tower down over here too, Port spotted. just to kind of help protect this. Boom. Reporting. Nice. Uh, was it? No, it wasn't that one. It was this one. Yeah. So a bunch of tools and some books. Ready for action. Uh, let's see. Any kind of bigger buildings still around here? Okay, there's one. Another one incoming. Oh, he kind of just ran into infected out here. Uh, we'll go to this one then. I don't want him to hop out too close to infected like that. Uh, let's see. So, yeah, so he's getting that stuff going. He's got that. Uh, go down here. There's like nothing in that building. Okay. Uh, get up this little market. We actually have a decent amount of food stocked up. Uh, let's see if we can invite some more people. Kind of like just standing out in the sun. Does that mean they're under the ground? Because like they have a face and they have grass above it. Like, do they dig themselves into the ground? Is that what's going on right there? That is, dude, that's wild. That'd be so scary for, like, an IRL thing. On my way. You know, you're sitting there, and it's like, oh, daytime's coming up. And then you just walk outside, and you notice they buried themselves under under your front lawn. And then they remember. <laughs> they come out, and they're like, ah, we remember you here. You ain't hiding from us anymore. That'd be, like, such a sketch situation. Go out there and just start digging them up like they're turnips or something. <laughs> start pulling them out the ground like they're carrots. That'd be hilarious. Nice. So yeah, they're just pulling all this stuff out. Yeah, we only have five of them there. Uh. Okay, I'll just say, I was like, I heard him get in his car. I just don't know where he got in his car at. Uh, go ahead up to the supermarket. Uh, let's see, what research can I do real quick? AR is 10. I did both construction. That's right. Oh, yeah, I was doing farming. Uh, yeah, we'll do this to enable the use of fertilizer. Operator. And, uh, let's see. So they're both almost done. Uh, I'm thinking about, I don't know, possibly getting rid of this tower and putting it over here to help support this side of the warehouse. I don't know. Start winding down for some rest. There's nothing left. Oh, hey, people. Ready for action. Join me. On my way. They're going to get here tomorrow, though. Uh, God, it's not really much that I'm finding out here. Roger. I'll bring them back. They're almost done searching that. Receiving. So he's at, what, 19 out of 20? God, I missed the box trucks from my other from my other playthrough. There are some Those box trucks were so nice. Search done. Operator. Let's do it. Another one incoming. Oh yeah, there's infected right there. Operator. Roger. On my way. Yeah, like leave him in his truck right here for the time being. Oh, okay, yeah, you got in this car. Uh, you're almost kind of full up. Go search this. There are some infected around here. Oh. Well, they're gone. Uh, they might not be. No, yeah, they're gone. Yeah, rip those guys. Free handguns, though. <laughs>
Uh, I was gonna send those other guys, but they're gonna be kind of full by then. So I'm just gonna send the, send out the truck to go collect his handguns. What else do you got? You have tools. Oh, you have a bunch of tools. Oh yeah, we'll get those. Oh, and I'm murking that guy. Come back with the two handguns. Gotta repair some of my other buildings though that are damaged like this one here. Oh, it's storming. They're gonna be out all day. Ready for action. Receiving. Come on. Sure Here we go. Now you're gonna come back. We're on the move. Oh, it's only three people? Oh, that saddens me. I was hoping for more. Send them in. Uh, let's see. Okay, he, okay, yeah, I was say I have five people free, but that's just because I cleared out some of those buildings. Uh, I'm gonna put those five people on here, and then once these guys get in here, we'll build this up, and then we'll start doing some more farms. Because once these are done too, that, that'll free up some of my people. That can do, have them doing other things. There we go, yep, so put two here. And where's my farm? Okay, up here it is. So we're going to be kind of building out some more of these farms here. Come on. Kind of get it hugging the building a bit. <laughs> as best as I can. Yeah, he's not that road sticking out too much right there. Uh, let's see. It's like I want to make it look nice, but it's kind of a hard thing to do when these roads are like shaping around everywhere. And we'll build that one there. Because, yeah, we have 13 tools. Yeah, we're good on tools for some of these farms at the moment at least. Uh, let's see. We're gonna go out here just to get some more of this food. Kind of stay ahead of the game a bit on, on the food game. Uh, it's gotta be careful because the hordes are still outside due to the storm. So we do have to be careful. Nice. Okay, so we finished, what, the cookhouse? Yep. And we finished the shelter. Let's go. Uh, Now, where did all my workers go is the question. Or have they not come back yet? Because I see that some of them, one of them moved here. Gonna have like 16 people building this. I'm a little confused. A little confuzzled here. Because having five people on this shouldn't be murking it, I don't think. Construction complete. Okay, nice. We finished that piece of wall. We're going to grab another field then. We're going to build a barn at some point also. Get some meat. We have the meats. Uh, let me see. How much fertilizer do I have? We have ten. Okay, we'll change you. Oh, I don't have fertilizer research yet. It's almost done though. Surprise, I actually didn't see any hordes coming up this way. Oh, that was quick. Yeah, we spotted some raiders. Little buildings. No food in that one either. Nice, okay, so we finished the, res or, uh, the grain research, or fertilization use research. Grain go burnt. Uh, ah, uh, do get a gal. Set up a gal sentry somewhere. <laughs> Set it up on the other side of the gate. I think I think it'd be cool if they added like helicopters or something in that point uh, at some point too. That would be very very awesome. Uh, we're gonna invite some more people too. Once again. Okay, they're almost done searching that. Nice. Uh, it's actually a, uh, some research material there. We'll go get that. Wait. It says to adapt shelter. Oh. 
Oh, there is infected in the house. Okay, that's fine. See, I'm a little confused. Because it says to adapt housing. And I got a lot of housing here. <laughs> like, made here. Another one incoming. Clear. Ah, into shelters. I made a house. Is it really going to, like... I think it is. It's really going to sit here and be like, Ah, not house. We need shelter. Yeah, that tower should... Yeah, that tower's okay. That's why it's nice to have the Fortify Towers, because they have a lot of HP for a tower. We're going to invite some more. So yeah, we're going to have to build a shelter. And I guess just get rid of it at some point. I need what 77 prepared, so 40, 50. Yeah, no. Uh, guess this would work. 79, 80. Yeah, I guess we'll build it out of this one currently. It just really sucks. Hostiles inbound. Uh. Because it's like, I built a house. <laughs> why why know that count? It's a living area. There are some infected around here. Clear. Receiving. So I'm just going to have to like build that, tear that down in the future, and then uh, it. build it back up, I guess. Oh, uh, wait, no. Building repurposed. Alright, uh, we're gonna take these guys off of here. We're gonna repair this. Do that. Uh, we're also gonna lower the amount of guys I have on this gate currently, so we're going under three. Just so I can kind of get that repaired fast. <laughs> nice, we're getting the farms built. Oh, nope. I don't know why I just clicked that. We're on the move. We're on the move. Waiting orders. Let's do it. There we go. Uh. Yeah, they're still searching out there. We're going to see what's kind of like on this lower southern section of this area. Yeah, because I see a lot of big buildings out here. This is mostly, I guess, farmland IRL from the way everything looks. It looks like it would definitely be farmland. Oh, supermarket there. Put up some of these bigger buildings down here. Down south, like. God, if these guys actually want to come out here and repair this now, that'd be great. Join us. Uh, let's see, we have four research. So we could do food preservation because we can go down to efficient cooking at least. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, get this uh, get this food cooked up pretty quickly. As quickly as we can. I gotta mess with my arm a bit because I've noticed it's off center, my boom arm from my mic. And it's kind of annoying me. I'm not gonna do it right now just in case I mess something up. Uh, but yeah, just, uh, I don't know. Just looking at it like this. It's just not, it's like not centered with my monitor and I don't like it because I'm sitting senator, sen senator, uh, the, 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 centered with my monitor. Man, words are hard. Uh, can't English correctly here. There we go. We're going to put those five people on this now to start building that shelter out. Oh, okay, wait, he did finish this. He just didn't uh, leave the building. Aw. Oh, wait, we got a lot. Never mind. We got a, We actually got a decent amount uh, going in here. Uh, yeah, I was hoping I could kind of see over that building, but no, it can't. Big sad. Oh, hello. Mr. Infected. Oh, there's another one here, too, attacking this tower again. 
This tower is actually getting hit a decent amount. They're, they're really coming through the northern wall up here. Roger. Uh, let's do this. So fortified gate. Oh, nope, not actual gate. I need fortified wall. Because what's his range? Okay, yeah, he can kind of see over that. So we'll do something like this. Oh, uh, it's going to be weird since that's a castle wall, yeah. Something like that, I guess, yeah. Yeah, because he can still shoot over it. So the wall will just stop him from directly hitting the tower. Oh, yeah, because it's not like they can dip through here. They'd have to go all the way around this way to come to, through that middle section. Oh, yep. There we go. Uh, I'm going to hold off on heading out at the moment. These guys just do not... Oh. I was sitting here. I was like, these guys do not want to find anything else. And then I look at it and it's like, oh. That's why they don't want to find anything else. There's nothing else for them to find. Makes a lot of sense. Uh, you know what? We come here, other truck. We're going to do this. Swap vehicles. You're gonna go on an expedition yourself. This guy is taking like what? They're taking such a weird route. I am so confused. Okay. <laughs> what? I think I have another rifle in here, don't I? To make this like a full rifle squad? Yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, let's go get those raiders while I'm at it. Reporting. Let's do it. Going there. Going there. Roger. Okay, we did fully. Yeah, we fully searched that. Let me click him. There we go. Uh, you're gonna go down to that corner. These guys outside or inside? Okay, they're inside. There's the oh, there's actually two groups of raiders here. On my way. Let's do it. Going there. We're on the move. Going there. We need backup. Going there. On my way. God, they did not want to shoot him. His stuff popped up over here, so I'm wondering if that was a model issue. Like, if the game read him here, but on my screen it read him there. That's what it kind of seemed like with how that was looking. Uh, so yeah, I got both these trucks out here now. On these expeditions. Oh. Ah, oh, this guy's. I always love how sarcastic this guy sounds. Always makes me think of Negan. The risk I took was calculated, but man, am I bad at math. <laughs> but man, am I bad at math. Operator on my way. Uh, let's see, I have these guys out here. Oh, that's where a lot of these guys went. Okay. A lot of my builders went straight into chopping trees. That makes a lot of sense now. I totally forgot I even had that going, to be honest. I'm out here like, where did my people go after they built this? That's where they went. <laughs> they went They went to go chop trees. Uh, let's see. So I should be able to go help him at some point now. Uh, and I could bring him into the fold in his little group. How much wood do I have? I have a decent amount of wood, and I'm still chopping a bunch of wood. Metal I'm really good on. I might do something like this right now. So we're going to take one guy off of there, put one guy on here. Just collect up a bit more wood faster. They're just sitting there beating down that, uh, beating down that wall. 
Oh. Hello, Mr. Infected. No more to find. Reporting. Going there. I don't really find much in there. Uh, let's bring you inside. Just driving down the street next to them. Oh. Yeah, they, they kind of hit them a little bit there. Oh, yeah, there's a, a building there, too, so it's not like they're going to be coming through that anytime soon. These guys are just opening up on them. Yeah, it's really it's really weird they don't shoot, like, straight over this. It kind of saddens me. But I guess, you know, uh, no, I think, I, yeah, IRL, they'd be able to hit that from that tower, I feel like. Lob a grenade over the wall. Now, you'd have to be careful with explosives around your walls, because uh, you don't want to bring your walls down and then bring them in. We're on the move. That's where a big issue would come in there. Oh, there's a raider inside my area. Yay! Bring me the people! Oh, that's eight people, too. Yeah! Nice. We're on the move. On my way. Waiting orders. On my way. Uh, another thing too, I feel like the raiders and stuff shouldn't know because when you, uh when you have the snipers or anybody setting up in buildings, um the AI raiders will like sit on the outskirts of that range sometimes and they won't come into the range. They'll like bounce back and forth. I feel like if they're hidden in a building, the AI shouldn't know that they're there and you know walk into range of say a sniper <laughs> i feel like that would just be a lot more realistic when it comes to that uh i'm gonna probably doing like a fortified gate here to kind of like block them from uh because they can just walk through this section right here do like a fortified gate and then connect walls right here and just fully, like, block this section off. And then in the future, just fully, like, kind of, like, take this area back over, I'd say. Because there's some, somewhere over here they're coming through, which I want to say it's probably right here since the wall's down. But I don't know. Because they, they, they can just slip through some of these areas, I've noticed. Reporting. Uh, let's see. Here we're down to 69 food. That's funny. Uh... Nice if they're coming in. Uh, yeah, cause that should be eight people. Nice. Okay, we're gonna straight up set up some more farming areas here with them, just to try to get some more passive food going. About right there, yeah, and then I can fit another one right here. So that'd be two, four, six. I guess I'll use up all eight people. Uh, we'll put this one right here. Boom. No, he's not in the tower anymore. I just realized the guy is not stuck in the tower. He's not immortalized anymore. He got out. He broke out of the bounds of the tower. Oh, well, finished the shelter. So that should give me some more people. I think they went back. Yeah, they went back out to work the, uh, the fields out here. So nice. We finished that. But I'm going to need to tear down this, which is which sucks because I just built it. But uh, I'd rather have houses instead of that. So I can keep my bonuses and stuff going. Uh, let's see. Stop working. We will build Someone a barn. That's only one worker. Probably like right here. I feel like this building would be great as a barn. Uh, no, this one. This one would be a lot better. Plus, we have a warehouse right here, so they can kind of just, like, walk it back and forth, the stuff. Okay, so it's going to take him a second to finish searching that building. Uh, so that's at 100% searched. Uh, go to, guess go to the next territory here. This one is, too. Jesus, dude. Okay, these expeditions are a lot easier. Like, at least out here, 
I'm blowing through these expeditions like crazy. Like super fast. No! Yeah, that was just such a bad idea for me to place a tool set building there. It really was. I might just let him destroy the building. Because there's no way I bring these guys back in time. I guess, yeah, that was just definitely a bad idea to do something like that with that building. For this reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Operator. Uh, these guys are done searching this. Roger. On my way. Hostiles inbound. Good amount of stuff out of that, actually. On my way. That was not a bad building. Port, that building is down. Yeah, we lost the tool set factory, but it's fine. Search done. We're not even going to use it anymore, so we're just going to get rid of it. Uh, I'm just gonna let you guys keep searching this, and then you'll just come pick the stuff back up. God, yeah, dude, it's just like... They just blow through these expeditions, like, super fast right now. Uh... Oh, those guys just got murked by some infected. Let's go, let's go finish those infected off and get those handguns. There we go, and we'll finish searching the building. Nice. Oh, there are some raiders down there. Oh, truck. We're on the move. On my way. Going there. Uh, we'll have to build a new tool set factory. I'm guessing probably one of these smaller buildings over here, since it's not along the walls. Uh, let's see. Yeah, and I can put three workers actually in this one, while the other one only had two. That's not too bad. Ready for action. Construction complete. They're coming. Ready for uh, go on finish these guys. Construction complete. Roger. Thank you. On my way. Roger. Let's do it. Let's do it. Reporting. On my way. Oh, that one's fully found. Uh, actually, we're gonna do this. Let's go search these outer sections here. Instead of just going all the way around. I guess it would be better to go all the way around, because I can remember easier, like, what I've searched. But it's fine. I really don't want to try to go across those raiders again. What are we? We're at up to 88 food, 97, 100? Yeah, let's go. Okay, uh... Let's invite some more people. Uh, let's go ahead up some of these small food buildings here. So far, though, like, we're kind of doing pretty well out here. As I just jinx myself and, you know, massive swarm just comes and hits me out of nowhere. Alright, nice. So that's almost done. Oh, good stretch. Yep. <sighs> Yeah, and they're going to be out here searching Operator. these. Oh, full moon. Cool. I don't have to worry about the infected being out tonight. Uh, I might... I'm going to send him to zero for the time being. Since it's like an inner wall section kind of thing. Uh... I guess Infected could still come up this way and attack this wall. So it's like I should probably leave this here. But I don't know. I feel like they're more likely to come and hit this tower, though, than, like, that wall. Hmm. But we'll bring it up to three. And we'll build out another field right here. Or I guess over here. Yeah. Boom. Boom. Uh, no, because I might... Yeah, because I might send this wall around a bit. Just to kind of give my HQ a bit more protection. 
Uh, let's see. You need more food. So you're going to hit up both those. And we'll just kind of see how this goes. I guess while we're waiting, something I'll bring up is... I do want to thank you guys again for, like, all the support you've been showing me. Like, it's, like I said, it's been crazy. Like, the channel's been up for two weeks. And, uh, like I said, we're just about to hit 200 subs. And we're just over 3,000 watch hours. Like, it's, it's wild to me. To think that this, <laughs> the channel blew up this, like, this quickly and this much. Um... Because we even, like... God, I want to say... Yeah, we even hit the... We hit the watch hours already for the first tier of monetization. Um, the only thing we need for the first tier of monetization is... Five, yeah, 500 subs. Um, but this is all within a year. So I feel like I would... With getting, you know, 200 subs in, like, the span of two weeks... I will, I should be monetized within the year, unless, like, this game and everything else, like, around the channel, I guess, just falls on its face. Um, but I don't know. I feel like once the game releases, though, there'll probably be a lot more hype around the game, because more people will be getting their hands on it. Um, which I feel like would, should help blow it up even more. But we'll kind of see, you know, if the game does ultimately flop and, like, the devs just get rid of it, then I'm gonna have to, like, try to pivot to a different game. And just hope that you know, everyone likes the, the games that I swap to. More than likely, they'd be like along these lines, though, of these kind of games. So, like Hearts of Iron and stuff like that. Like RTSs, top down games. Um. Because I feel like that would just kind of be in line with the with this. Um. And probably kind of draw the same crowd. Because honestly, one of the things I do like about these kind of games, too, with you guys, is that if there's something I know or something that I do wrong, you guys just, like, let me know in the comments. And it, it helps me learn the game more, to be honest. Or just, like, ideas outside of the box. <laughs> you know, because a lot of you guys really think outside the box. And it surprises me sometimes. I'm just like, oh. It's like, I would have, like, I just didn't think about that. Or if I, like, brought it up, and then it's like... I just didn't think about how much it would be, like, impacting. Uh, let's not have you leave the building real quick. Is he... No, he's not coming at you. Okay. We're going to send you down this way and then send you back this way. There we go. Uh, we'll hit up this building. Oh. Oh, they're hitting this. I thought they'd actually come around here, but they're not. Yeah, I don't understand why these guys aren't coming in through this way anymore like they were originally. Because they used to. They're just not doing it anymore. Oh, yep. This one came into the top. Ah, so they are going around now. Yep. Yeah. Nice kind of like walked through that wall right there. Probably like right there where this goes through that. Yeah. Uh, you have noticed with the castle walls that, uh, they're, like, directly kind of below it. They won't actually fire on them. It's kind of saddening. Uh. See, I don't know, because it's, like, they won't really... They won't be able to hit them like that is the issue. Could do something like this to kind of protect the tower slightly. I could just get... Actually, I'm just going to deconstruct this. Like, I don't know why I'm sitting here protecting this. Just deconstruct it and place my own wall there like that. Yeah. These guys are, like, way too close. I don't like that at all. <laughs> See, I, don't, I do not like that in the slightest. I can't remember if I brought this up. I think I did. But, like, the ultimate, like, game killer from what people were, t were saying is just, like, saving your game and then reloading your game later on. Um, like, will absolutely, like, decimate your saves sometimes when it comes to bugs. And I feel like that's probably why my other two saves have, been, have broke. Because a lot of times, you know, I'll play, I'll play, like, an hour or two. 
probably record two videos and I'm like, okay, I'll wait till like, you know, today or tomorrow or like the next day um, to play some more. Because my biggest thing is I try not to burn myself out uh, on it. And just like, you know, naturally, it's just playing it. Ah, we're out of fertilizer. No. Yeah, we got to get chemistry research so we can start turning fuel into uh, fertilizer more. Oh, I just noticed some of these farms only have one people, like one person on them. I think it was only that one, yeah. There we go. I think we get fertilizer from the barn, too. So once we get the barn set up, it'll be better also. Uh, let me bring these guys back, because they should be good now, right? Oh, no, never mind. Yeah, well, that place is almost fully searched, and they haven't even got a full inventory out of it yet. God. But yeah, we'll start. We're going to deconstruct this and then build our own walls here. And then we'll kind of leave this as like an inner inner outpost, like I kind of did with this tower. And if I need to, I could put people in it. Something I gotta be careful of though is this right here, like somebody coming down here without my people here, because they'll hit that warehouse. Because they do just run straight through that. It's kind of dumb because I keep forgetting that. It just keeps going down like that, and it's like, ah, can you guys stop? Uh, yeah, we're just going to start deconstructing these. Because this is on the inside anyway, so we'll leave... Yeah, we'll leave that wall, because we're going to connect it by the building right here and go like that. Uh, you guys can come back. We're on the move. Oh, some of these guys got blasted. Let's see, oh, we have nobody actually working in the arms factory at the moment. I did take the people out of it. That's fine. Yeah, I only have three guys in this. That's also fine, though. Yeah, they're just blasting these guys right here. There's one left, yeah. Nice little guard towers, you know. Uh, we're gonna go down to two on that. We're on the move. Oh yeah, it's doing that. There we go. Let's do it. Roger. I'll put that one guy there. On my way. Nice. Oh, hello. That one came in from somewhere down down yonder. Help them out a bit. Uh, we'll see if um, these guys should be able to fire on them, right? Ah, oh, they can see him. It's just, I guess, the wall's blocking it. Uh, let's see. Currently, what? 82 food? Uh. Go there, yeah. Oh. This is what I was talking about. Oh, I like how they're trying to go for the tower still. That's kind of funny. Yeah, they, it's weird. They get, like, bugged at times. When they try to go inside the building like that. Uh, We're going to do this. We could use a gate. Because they need to be able to come through this area is the thing. Yeah, we're going to use a gate. We're going to do this. And I just won't have everybody, like, in the gate. Because I shouldn't need that many people to, uh, to hold the gate. Uh, we'll do that. And then we'll connect this one here. Make sure that the infected just can't, like, sneak past the wall there. Like I did on my New York one. There was, like, a sliver and the infected could get through it. That was so annoying. Uh, we're going to lower this to zero, put the five people on there. We're going to lower the wood chopping to zero. We're just going to try to get a lot of this built up because we do have, yeah, we have we have enough resources kind of stocked up. We're going to get this barn going also. Operator. Get up and burn 
Uh, let's see. We're definitely gonna need more food, so we're gonna go out. And we're gonna hit up all these little markets out here. We're on the move. Hostiles inbound. Operator. Nice. Uh, so yeah, he's done searching this. There's nothing there. So whatever he has, yeah, that's everything. Oh god, there's so many raiders over here. Okay. Uh, you're gonna come inside. Yeah, you're gonna murk these raiders while you're out here. Nice. Sending out the squad. Going there. Nice, I guess four handguns though. Oh yeah, it was in this little area here. On my way. We're on the move. We're gonna hit up all those little supermarkets. Waiting orders. Uh you know, bring this stuff back. This way we can have it on hand. And then I'll just send you back out. Uh so yeah, they're getting these built up. That's nice. That stuff's getting... This castle walls are getting tore down. And we'll just kind of see how this goes. Nice. We're going to hit this up. Ah, uh, no, just get back. Let's do it. Reporting. On my way. Going there. There we go. I was like, come on. Yeah, you're going back out there because you should still have a little bit of search. Yep. Operator. Even though that was his section, but that's fine. Oh, hey, it's a full moon. Okay, so I don't have to worry about any of that. Full moons are actually the safest because the um. The raiders don't come outside, and the infected don't come outside. <laughs> Receiving. Roger. So it is legit the safest time. Uh, let's see. We're on the Let search that building. Ready for action. Let's do it. Going there. Ah, so annoying. There we go. Uh, this one's already been fully searched, so we'll send you up the to the northern block there. Orders. Yeah, that'll be nice. Gonna try to invite some more people. Oh yeah, four grain currently. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're only like five people. Oh wait, I didn't realize they just finished the barn. We do not need seventeen people in the barn right now. Uh, we'll go with like 10 currently. Uh, we'll swap over to cooking the meat instead of the grain. And then we'll put two people back on making firearms. Just get these firearms. Actually, no, 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 no. Not until we get AK. We'll, we'll place them on AK research because we currently have 23 handguns. So we're phenomenal on some handguns right now. We are really good on some handguns. <laughs> Uh, oh, okay, they just saw him in the building. I was like, wait, it's a full moon, though. It's a full moon. Um, On my way. be kind of cool if there would be such a thing as, like, daywalkers. Uh, as, like, as, like, a special infected. These red buildings are kind of getting on my nerves. Oh, no, they'd be able to get through that one. No, nah, we'll just, we'll, we'll stop that. Uh, let's start tearing down some of these inner buildings here. Yeah, you know what? Let's, uh, I'll keep these on zero currently. And then we'll just use up our people to start tearing this stuff down. Again, and we'll just start constantly tearing down these, like, inner buildings. Let's see. Let's kind of see how this goes. Oh, wait, we got 10 research. Let's research ARs. Let's invite some more people. We do need to repair some stuff because I know this tower is kind of damaged. This tower is kind of damaged, but they still have really good amounts of HP. So it's not something I really have to like 100% worry about currently. Uh, 
I see at the moment, like I said, they, they usually attack this. They haven't gone after these walls as of yet, so I could take the two guys out of this. I feel like it's gonna backfire on me though, me doing that. But we'll see. Uh, I do wanna extend this fortified wall out a bit more though. And of course these are gonna be in my way, so we will get rid of both of these. Yeah, put those two guys on there instead currently. And we'll just kind of like, you know, see how this goes. Oh yeah, there's the stairway to heaven. <laughs> Dude, that, that still like just makes me laugh. That it's just like ramping to the stars. Oh. Nice, we're in luck. <laughs> More firearms. Right. Out of resources. Or are you just gonna sit here at like a hundred percent? Oh, there you go. You like bugged out? Oh, okay, yep. So apparently, uh, I guess we're not, you know, getting that stuff. Cool. <laughs> awesome. No raider stuff for us. Hey, more people. Let's go. Was it seven? Yep. Construction ready. Nice. We finished this out. Sir, we've Send them in. We're going to accept. We're going to bring this down to three instead of six. Uh, we're going to put some people on this. We need one extra guy. Make sure. Do I? Okay, I do have full amounts of workers on these. Currently, I'd say my weakest area is probably definitely right here. <laughs> you know, because I got the one fortified tower right here. Uh, still going to start tearing down some more of this. So we just got a good amount more people, which is so nice. We're just going to... Well, we're probably going to keep this bigger building here. So we can actually use that for something. Especially with the warehouse being right here. And we're just going to queue up a lot of these. It's like my little deconstruction section here. Okay, nice. So far, so good. Uh, we are stacking up on fertilizer from the barn now, so we're gonna start hitting up these farms with fertilizer for their next batches, since we have a more passive way of making fertilizer. We would still like to do chemistry though for the fertilizer like that, but so far we're good. Uh, how much meat do we have? Okay, so we're kind of, you know, falling behind in the meat department. But other than that, we're kind of good. Clear. Oh, yeah, these guys are actually staying empty, which is what I'm wanting. Uh, yep. Reporting. Honestly, it's so nice being able to, like to tear down a building and it'd be gone pretty quickly but it's at the same time it just doesn't give as much resources but yeah like you know with all my new york gameplay and stuff like this the massive skyscrapers take so long to deconstruct huh 69 <laughs> we have 69 food uh let's see they're at 97 percent in that location they're at 52 percent okay so far good so far though we're pretty good i'd say as like some kind of defense of not having to have a squad here like every single night um in that aspect i think we're doing really well right now honestly having like warehouses in like different sections is really good got like a triangle of warehouses going here um because you know having multiple buildings spread out instead of like near each other uh, can usually be pretty bad on the logistics, uh, but with having multiple uh, warehouses everywhere, nothing I really have to worry about. My alarm just went off. <laughs> oh, it's still going off. I legit stopped it, but it's uh, decided it did not want to stop. I have an appointment at 9.30, and uh, I was sitting there, I was like, oh, okay, yeah, just in case I wake up at 7.00. 
or I need to get up at 7.30, just give me time to prepare and everything. And then it's like, oh, hey, I woke up really early. I couldn't stay asleep. Search done. Reporting. On my way. Roger. Oh, so we got one infected coming in right here. Yeah. I was about to say, I was like, it's kind of a quiet night. <laughs> Not much, you know, going on. Morning, everybody. Time to earn your living. It would be cool, though, like, say, if, you know, the people in this tower, they had, like, a rank. And so, like, the more, uh, like, infected or raiders they merc, the more experience they can gain. Like, how your normal people can gain experience. Ready for action. And, like, no just get better at stuff. I feel like the towers, that'd be really cool, an aspect of the towers. We're on the Nice, or these are getting finished getting destructed. I could finish the wall going around. I might just connect it to this building here and just do something like that. The only issue is my vehicles wouldn't be able to come through. <laughs> I'm going to have to build like some kind of gate, which I might do a gatehouse and just not have anybody in it. Wait, I have 22 people. What? Why do I have 22 people? What finished? Something finished somewhere, and I don't I don't know what it was. Uh, let's see, how's the grain? Okay, so we have a decent amount of grain, so we're going to bolster our barn a bit here. We have a lot of food, too, a lot of meat, so we'll bolster the cookhouse also. Uh, we are going to add... Okay, the guys deconstructing, what are they? Because they're not, it doesn't look like they're considered builders. So I'm guessing they'd be considered scavengers. Right? Yeah. Ah, but if I add them to it, they're probably going to get added to this also, which I'm trying to stay away from currently. One guy on that. Uh. Thought one of these only had like four people on. Oh, no, I have two people on it. There we go. We'll do that. Oh, nice. These, uh, those got demolished. So I need to be able to bring vehicles through here. Just in case, you know, like say this gate gets hit or something else gets hit. I need like other ways to get vehicles and stuff in. Uh, but, like I said, it would probably be smarter just to have a... I'll put, like, an empty gate here. Because it's not like they come through this section anyway. They come through here. Um, so I could just build a gate here and then leave it empty. I still kind of want to build it for... Well, no, because these walls don't have as much HP. So we can more than likely do a metal gate and be totally fine. Because it's probably not like they're going to hit that gate anyway. And then we'll just put a fortified wall here connecting these. Like that. There we go. And this will kind of just fully protect this. These are bricks, though. We do got to remove these and make these into fortified walls. Waiting orders. Uh, oh, we got some raiders hanging out right here. Yeah, let's not go inside that building with those raiders, because uh, I had a had a bad time last time with that, if, you're, if you remember. Roger. Trying to go into the buildings. With the raiders Nobody inside. Up, oh, so we are coming up on our hour here in a bit. So we'll probably do about one more day, maybe. Yeah, because I usually end it on the mornings. We'll probably do this next day and there then end it on the right night. Up, oh, yep, I was right. Remember when I talked about uh, them coming through this section now since this tower is not going to be up? That's what happened. Yeah. Going there. So yeah, I'm gonna have to like actually leave some people in that. Huh. Waiting orders. Roger. My worst fear was realized. <laughs> but then I beat that fear down. Uh we're gonna lower that by two, put two people on this tower. Okay, nice. So they just instantly come out back to the tower. That's not bad actually. So yeah, if I need to, I could always just Say, like, one of these gates, I have three people in. I could just lower one of these other work areas and then be like, okay, go hop in that tower. How many tools do we have? We have 12 currently. Okay. Waiting orders. Let's do it. 
but nice. So yeah, that so that 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 wall is back up to being defended. But yeah, this is probably our, this is definitely our weakest link right here. Now that I think about it, because all they gotta do is break through this, get rid of that tower, and then there's the HQ. Uh, let's go get these raiders. Looks like they're about to run into the tower itself. Oh, I'm kind of like baiting them with these guys though. Yeah. At first they weren't gonna walk into it, and then it was like, oh hey. There's people there. We're on the move. Yeah, it's weird that he's not driving through this way now. I don't know, it's like once I set up this gate, now they're just like prioritizing driving through that gate. Oh. Some people just automatically got added to this. I'm about it though. Needs need one extra person. Uh How's it still looking? 14 or 15 grain, 14 of that. Oh, wait, that's because uh, my deconstruction's here. Oh, nice. So we finished that research on the rifles. So we'll actually start producing rifles instead of handguns and just leaving that to like slowly make rifles. <laughs> Clear. We're on the move. Nice. We got some food, some ammo. Nice, nice. This is getting kind of built out there. Operator, let's do it. On my way. Construction ready. Uh, let's see. Think about just kind of closing this off over here. I don't know. Stop working. Start winding down. Rest. Oh, they finished this tower. Uh, we're not gonna have anybody in it though. Like I said. Uh, do you want to take the hand? No, I'll leave the handguns just in case I ever have to throw people in it again. And they got these guys running back and forth. Building clear. They're breaking into our building. Operator. Oh. Oh, yeah, they're hitting that wall again. That's fine. That tower just got them, though. Uh. Roger. Actually, go hit up that building. Hit up just some of these bigger buildings. Because they might have some more, you know, stuff in it. Uh, let's see, we got six people on hand. Throw five into this one, one into that one. Just start deconstructing. Oh, I do need to build these walls out right here, so we're going to get rid of that too. And this will just be our way through this section here, because we're just going to fully block this off. Is the plan like that? Oh, I thought I was deconstructing this for a second. I was a little confused. Okay, yes, yeah, that. I was like, uh, I don't want to destroy the tower. I need the tower. Oh, uh, wait. I did say this was going to be... Okay, yep. <laughs> so this is going to be where we're ending our third episode of Caracasson. Uh, French Castle Settlement. But I do want to say, you know, as I'm heading out, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and or night. And like I said, you guys are absolutely killing it. Um, the channel's just been... It's been booming. Like it's it's honestly been crazy. I've been I yeah. <laughs> I've got like a live counter on a monitor on the left side. Uh, and it's just it's it's been crazy. Uh also, uh if you have made it to the end here, if you, you know, enjoy my content, enjoy what I do, you know, my commentary, hanging out with you guys, uh consider subscribing, you know, liking, commenting. Uh it means the world to me. It means the world to the channel. And yep, I hope you guys just, you know, have a good time.